So today I'm out again doing my abandoned Spain. Now this place I'm going to now, some of you might recognise it already, but some of you probably won't. I've got to say, when I first arrived here in Spain nearly six years ago, this is one of the first places I wanted to go and have a look at. Uh, I've done many videos on this place. It's just an amazing place. I'll tell you more. I'm going to show you a clip of the road going up to it, but I hope you enjoy the vid. So if it's your first time visiting my channel, my name is Sean. I've been living out in Spain now for over five years. I live in the southeast of Spain, the Costa Calida, the Murcia region, just outside the lovely town of Maveron, not far from the port. Also, don't forget to check out my playlist. There's loads of videos on there you can watch, guys. Also, please check out my social networks, which is Twitter, Instagram, my Facebook group. You're most welcome to join my Facebook group. I put all the up-to-date information on there and not forgetting TikTok. Oh, hopefully you guess where I am now. So this is what I class as abandoned. It's uh, an old coastal defense uh, battery. It's put here back in the 1930s. Took a lot of work, guys. They had to ship the, ship the gun barrel. And I'll give you a little bit more history about that. Back uh, sort of 1928 time, uh, Argentine order the battle cruiser. Um, don't forget this is just after the first war. Second war wasn't even getting ready yet, but obviously empires were getting bigger. So they, you know, they ordered this battleship, but obviously for some reason, probably didn't have the money, um, it fell free. And Spain actually bought the gun turrets, you can see. Um, what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna turn around, because there's two gun turrets up here. I'll just... Uh, Face it the other way. So that's, the, that's, that's one of them. Um, they were made by Vickers in the UK. They're big, they got a range of 20 miles out to sea. Now these guns were never fired in jest, but they were probably used for, for practicing. Um, there's no point putting up these guns, you're never gonna use them. Now where we are at the moment, I'll just bring it around to the other gun. Where we are at the moment, <clears throat> is um, one of the batteries. There's actually three batteries up here on this ridge. There's one further back, which I'll show you on the way back. Um, it's a smaller mortar battery. It was just put there, just in case there was an invasion down at Islapana area, or Alhora, as I should say. Um, but those, those mortars were removed during the Spanish Civil War. They were put on down towards Almeria. But these two big guns here will stay there. A bit further down, which I'll show you in the video, is another gun battery. Then if I go back this way and just walk over here slightly, you just might catch, capture it on the top there. Right on the very top of that hill is another gun battery called the Watch, Watchman Tower. That was really put there for anti-aircraft. 
because obviously once this was put in place the Spanish Civil War broke out and then obviously during the Civil War and afterwards it was updated um, obviously for airplane now obviously because you know Spain was not in the Second War anyway but it still kept its waters clear from any ships coming in that it thought might be hostile so a little bit of history I'll put a lot of clips together I've been here so many times guys I mean I if you check out my playlist I've called it the guns of Mazarin the guns of Cartagena now it's actually in the Cartagena um, region if I walk over this way or I'm gambling I'll show you where the Cartagena Navy base is right in the distance and that's what these guns were for and these were not the only batteries along this coast there's further two more um, built around the same period and there's gun batteries all along this coast that's virtually all abandoned so I will be bringing out more of the abandoned coastal defense systems bunkers you name it they've got it here and what's good about this place it's free there's no restrictions you can actually go under this machine here they got underground tunnels show you where the ammunition was kept obviously the ammunition is all being left now you've got the engine room that made those turrets move but right in the distance you can't really see it is um Cartagena but what you will notice there is ships parked out in the bay they're waiting to get permission to go in to unload because it's not just about the naval docks there it's also a place for fuel for a gas and uh, oil which they drop off yeah anyway hope you enjoy the video that's the main thing there's a doggy there But these guns are massive and you get a lot of people for some reason i've got to walk the barrel i'll put some clips up of that as well 